What is this place, man? It's a gift shop. I designed it myself to feel like a trophy room. More in the motif of the museum. Oh, wait, so you're turning this whole place into a museum? Yes. I've already started the process of making this a historical site. You're actually the first person to be in here. Feel free to Twitter a blog spot, any of it. Uh, you know what? Actually, I'm kind of in a rush. I... May I show you something? I'm... I, I promise to get you your piano. I... But I really think you'll like what I have in store. Sure. What's in there? Go ahead. Walk in. Hey, uh, Teddy. This is my favorite part of the museum. What the hell is this? This is my father. He's the reason for all of this. When me and Benny were children, he instituted a very rigorous training method. Piano, three hours a day, twice a day, exams on Sundays. And that it failed. Meant physical punishment. <laughs> he wanted the best out of us. It's because of him we have all of this. So you saying your dad uh, needs to beat you so you'd be good at piano? To be good at life. We were a sacrifice. Well, uh, I'm not trying to, like, shit on your dad or nothing, man, but that seems a little unnecessary. Most people wouldn't understand. To make an omelet, you have to break a few eggs. I mean, to build bridges, people have to fall. Are you not mad at your dad? Of course not. There was no way for a child to understand what's at stake. He just wanted the best for us. My father used to say, great things come from great pain. I want this wing of the museum to be dedicated to great fathers. My father, Joe Jackson, Marvin Gaye Sr., Tiger Woods' his father, Serena Williams' his father. The father that drops off Emilio Estevez in the breakfast club. Hey, uh, look, I'd, I'd like to make this transaction as efficient as possible. So is there any documents I got to sign for tax purposes? Of course. <laughs> 